So here's a new program we're going to try playing with a little bit. It's called Sketchboard. So you're going to go ahead and go to sketchboard.me and it will take you to this location. You want to log in with Google so you don't have to enter any of that. It'll create an account with you using your school email. So we'll push that. Mine's already set up so I don't have to push the buttons. You're going to go ahead and it'll ask you to create a new one. And I'm going to create a new one down here. And it's going to look something like this. There's a couple of different things you can do. We have this as a team board. So on your team board, you can actually give it a name. Mine is episode two. Um, and you can choose to have personal boards, team boards, or public boards. It's up to you. And you can also choose your teammates and it shows who's on there. So if you want to choose teammates, you add the teammates. It'll also prompt you when you're creating a brand new account as well. Um, you can do a new team and you can also rename it. Okay, so to add a team member, you want to go in here, type in your team member's email address. Um, so and you just go ahead and add them. The cool thing about this is everyone can work on here together at the same time and add the same stuff. And what we're going to be looking at specifically is looking at adding things on here. So we're going to be making a map, a story map of what happens in episode four. So you can choose to actually make a real map similar to what you would see like a treasure map or um, a map for driving or whatever, okay? So you can do that and you can use that using freehand. You can choose different colors. You can also choose different thickness on it. It's up to you. And you can also choose to undo things. On this side over here, you'll see that this automatically opens and closes. There's a couple different things you can choose as well for sketching, flows. Um, there's different things you can choose. There's mind maps, there's generals. Um, it just depends on what you want to use. You can also choose to be on the hand here and you can double click and there will be different options here as well. So it's up to you on what you want to use as a team. Um, and so for example, if you want to draw a map and then add map road signs, you can do this. And you can retype in here something that happens in the story. So for example, they um, meet a new person. And then you got that. You can add something else. You can add a person here. And maybe you want to um, add information onto that. So you can either choose another box to add to them right here and give some more details. Um, but notice also if you click on one thing and then you click on another thing, it will change stuff. So we have that as well. You can also leave comments on there. Um, you can change it. You can connect it. You can switch things to the order that they're in. If you want to send things to the front and the back, if you want to duplicate it, you can do that as well. Um, and if you want to delete it, you click on it. You can push backspace or delete or push the trash can as well. So it's up to you. And then you can add any of your other extras on here. The fun thing is you do get to work together on it. Uh, so you wanna make sure you're not being rude and deleting other people's work. You wanna be kind. Um, and then at the end, also make sure that you are going to be able to save this and not lose it, okay? So you can share it, you can publish it. Um, you can unshare with the team if you need to do that, depending on what you're doing. You can switch teams if you got on the wrong one. It is totally up to you. So that is it in a gist. Go ahead and play around with it a little bit, but you do have an assignment to get done on it. Have fun.